is Scott and I'm going to show you how to build a computer. First of all, I'd like to say I'm, I'm not a professional in any way. I don't uh, work at a computer shop. I don't have any certifications in, in, in any of this. I'm just a typical geek that likes to build computers. And um, if you're new to this or you've never built a computer, um, it may sound like a daunting task, really hard and difficult, like you have to be a scientist to do this. And you really don't. Um, I learned how to build computers um, simply by trial and error. And um, I, really, I really don't build a computer. All I do is just assemble the parts. It's like Lincoln Logs or something, you know? It's, it's, really, it's really pretty simple once you get the basics and know really what you have to do. Um, all these parts here um, I got from Newegg.com. I just went online and ordered them all. And um, they came overnight and I'm just going to build it. Um, today is February 14th, 2008. And, um, the part, the, this particular system I'm going to build today is really good, nice, fast, sick system, and it costs about all these parts cost about seven thousand um, dollars. You don't have to spend nearly that much to build a computer. You could probably get, you know, you know, the parts for probably five hundred dollars. Um, but all the the parts um, or the the components are essentially the same, whether it's a seven thousand dollar system or a five hundred dollar system. Um, they're about about seven different essential parts that you need to build a computer. The first one is, um, you know, and I'll make a metaphor I'm referring to body parts. Um, the first one is the motherboard, and uh, that's right here. And um, this is kind of like the skeleton of the computer. Um, it's the thing that holds everything, all the other parts get plugged into this. The, the second one is, um, and this, yeah, this is like the skeleton. The second one is um, the CPU or the central processing unit or the processor. Um, this is like the brain of, of the computer. This one happens to be a quad core, three gigahertz processor. It's a fast processor for today. Um, the third one is as the RAM or the random access memory or the you know just the memory. It's uh, it's like the short term memory of the computer. And um, another one is uh, the hard drive. This is like the long-term memory of the computer. This is where all the information is stored. This happens to be a one terabyte hard drive. And I also have some SCSI hard drives, SCSI 320. Uh, when I say SCSI, I'm referring, that's referring to the connection. Um, and this is some other hard drives. And, and also the CD-ROM. This is the thing that reads the CDs, and you'll need that to install the operating system in the beginning. And um, of course, the case, um, the big gray box that everything fits in is here. And um, another one, you need a video card. Um, this is basically like the eyes of the computer. This is what you plug the monitor into, and that this, this um, renders the images that go to the monitor. And then also you need a power supply, which basically is just that. It's a power supply. It supplies the power to the thing. And um, that's basically you know, the basic um, elements of, of a computer that you need to do to, to build a computer. And so I guess let's get started. OK, what I've done now is I've uh, taking some of the things out of the box and I'm going to install the, the CPU or the processor and I'm going to install the RAM. And I'm going to do that before I put the um, motherboard into the box. This is the processor. As you can see it's very little. All the memory and the power is, not the memory, but the power is done this little tiny chip. And, uh, the instructions for a specific CPU installation is in the manual that came with the processor. Just like that. And this is the fan. It's the thing that keeps the processor cool. It gets very hot.
plug that in. This little black back plate that came with the case is not conducive to the motherboard, but this one is. This one came with, with the motherboard, so I'm going to trade, trade it out. Put the motherboard in here on top of the screws. installed. Yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. It's a nice fatty video card. How thick that thing is. Oh, I see it's not going to fit. Wow, isn't that fucking lovely? Be really de delicate. Very fragile. Just line it up. Slot. Make sure you push it down straight and even. So it just clicks right in there. And then go ahead and put some screws in. Okay, then I installed a power supply, which is right here, and I just uh, screwed it into the back of this right here. Okay, now I'm going to attach the power cables. The main power cable. New power supply. It's here. It's going to plug right into this spot right here. I'm going to plug in the power to the video card. These two connectors. Okay, now I've installed the two CD-ROM drives in these bays right here, and I installed the hard drive right down here in the middle, and um, now I'm going to attach the cables to it. There's two cables, one for the data, one's for the power. I'm just going to plug them right in. So that's how to build a computer. Um, we installed the motherboard, we added the CPU, the memory, the hard drives, the video card, and the CD-ROM. And then we took and put all that in a case. And uh, that's it. That's how to build most of a computer. Yeah. Fuck yeah.